I want you to carry this round the road for me. And don't take no talk from nobody. Just do what me say you do. Driver, don't stop at all. Alright, all right, my people, who we are talking about? The good old Jamaican reggae dancer, musician, the icon, Bujo Bantan, the Gargamel. Can you believe it, my people? Bujo Bantan is back on US soil after getting released from federal prison. Right? In 2018, not even 10 years on Bujo Bantan, they back in America. Unbelievable. So him have that to celebrate that him get back in visa and they back in America. But at the same time, Bujo Bantan is still in a little bit of a mourning. Things not so bright because him only lose him son a couple weeks ago, me people. So that's still no wear off, yes. But in the meantime, if you who not understand what is going on with Bujo Bantan, why a lot of people surprised of him getting back his US visa so soon, less than 10 years, and back in America for Uncle Sam's soil? Me I go show you right now. Me people, in December 2009, Drug Enforcement Administration agent remanded Bujo Bantan to custody in Miami where the U.S. attorney charged him with conspiracy to distribute and possession of more than 5 kilograms of white white powder. Bujo Bantan was then moved to, to the Pinellas County Jail where he rem remained until trial. Me people, them locked down Bujo Bantan and Bujo Bantan was sentenced to 10 years and 1 month but under good behavior, Bujo Bantan was released in seven years' time. Me people, ya, ya understand? Seven years' time in a hour time, but in a prison time, you know say that equate to about ten years. Because if I'm not lying, I think it's eight months they consider as one year in certain prison term. Because them count day and night, me people, right? Anyway, Bujo Bantan was released from federal prison in McRae Correctional Institute in Georgia on December 7, 2018 and was deported back to Jamaica. But this is where the celebration all happened and now my people. And at this are the part we have a lot of people surprised as to how Bujo Bantan is back in America so soon. And normally when you get deported, it takes like about 10 years before you even see back or even can apply or do anything if you go back in America. So make we see where the surprise comes in. Bujo Bantan back in US says God is amazing. Of course, he's going to go up if he get him American visa back again. No surprises dear me people. Veteran dancer and reggae entertainer. Bujo Bantan has returned to the United States after nearly four years. Wow. God is amazing. Declared a smiling Bantan to his fans as he laughed with producer DJ Khalid in what could be described as a joyous moment for the two. Because one thing about DJ Khalid, DJ Khalid rate Bujo Bantan and Sizzler and Capitan and Barrington Levy and the man them people. Nobody can go around that, right? God is amazing. That's the way them have to say, and there is no surprise there. The artist born Mark Myrie confirmed his return to Miami in an Instagram live video shared by Khalid, expressing gratitude for his return to the U.S. Oh gosh, man. The Jamaican said Khalid was the first person he had to visit on his return to U.S. soil. As a free man, Bantan returns marks a significant milestone in his career following his release from federal prison in December 2019 after serving time rel rel relative to a white, white conviction. They say 2019, but actually it should have been December 7, 2018 when he was sent back to Jamaica, my people. Khalid, a long-time friend and collaborator, welcome Bujo Bantan back to Miami saying, 
I haven't seen my brother Bantan here in Miami in about 15 years. I am so blessed. Cause we know say Khalid rate Bojo Bantan already. Khalid reflected me people. Right? And their sheer journey in the impact Bojo Bantan had on his own musical evolution. You have been my brother from day one. I love you and appreciate what you have done in my career from day one. This is history, stated Khalid. For his part, Bantan expressed gratitude to his fans and supporters across the US. I want to send much love to all my fans out there in the other states. The, the, the gar Gargamel is back on the ground again. Who could have believed this man? Who no happy? Which Bujubantan Gargamel fans no happy right now? Say the Gargamel is back in America, the land of opportunity as they call it. Said Bantan. With a wide smile, so you know, say all the in job when they come right round here, so I be a teeth the people. He reaffirm his commitment to his craft and his audience. It's been a long time I haven't seen you, my fans. It's been a long time my feet have not walked on this side of the world. Nothing before the time, and now is the time. So let's get the music going. Let's get the vibes going. Let's pick up ourselves and let's remember who we are and let's get lively, said Bujo Bantan. Me people, you can hear the joy of us saying at the back. Let me tell you this. No matter where you entertain I want to say, not until them get back them US visa or anything, them things start shut again, them happy again. Right? What do you see where Sizzla Kolonji get back film US visa as well when you can travel go back to uh, um, uh, America and now here is Bujo Bantan more surprising to anybody than any other given that Bujo Bantan spent time in America for certain things. You hear me I say so nobody at all now look for see Bujo Bantan, the Gargamel back in America yet so soon my people so this is where it all surprising since his release from the confinement in the US, Bantan has signed with Island Records, Rock Nation, and released two albums, Upside Down in 2020, and Born for Greatness. However, his return to US is seemingly bittersweet as he recently lost his son, Miles Myrie, who passed away at age 20. So I it me tell you, say, even though Buju Bantan has something to celebrate, getting back his visa, Heading back to America, in that same breath, him still have a lot of things a weigh him down. And, you know, him still have a bit of grief going on because him lose him 20 year old son. You know, you no matter who you is, whether you was playing a father role or you weren't playing a father role in that child's life. The fact that you know see a year youth and you know of him and you and him talk and connect and all them things there, even though you probably not see each other regular. Because that are one of the things with entertainers. Them not get to spend a lot of time with them pitney. Worse, a lot of entertainers who have a lot of kids out there. But despite all of that, if your child pass away, it will have a every weight for your heart. Believe me when me tell you that. Right? Bantan return to the US marks a new chapter in his career and fans seem to be eagerly anticipating his next move. On his own Instagram page, he posted several photographs, one of which has him reading a book in what appeared to be a private jet. The entertainer was seen in another photograph in which he shared a moment in what appeared to be a studio with Khalid. Long was the road. Many were the, many were the travels. But the journey of 1,000 miles begin with a single step. Miami, Simia, wrote the entertainer. People, among the persons who celebrate Bantan's return to the U.S. was opposition leader Mark Golden, who is also in Miami for this weekend. Time come, wrote Golden. Wrote entertainer Bounty Killer, long live the king. Reggae singer Graham Smagan said, so grateful. So my people who no can see whole heap of people are sending them, 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 them happiness, them, them gratitude, them appreciation for Sissy Bojo Bantan back on the street again, back on American style. And the Gargamel, 
All me can say to you. You do over 10 years in an American prison, Gargamel. We know you learned your lesson because we see you was well behaved in a prison. And you know, it was 10 years in a dear prison, but roughly 7 years to we. And in no time, there you are again, back in America for American style. I don't think I have to say this, but Bujubantan, Gargamel, I think you have a lot of people in your corner who encourage you, so there is no way. I would have even have the slightest idea that it would even cross your mind to make the same mistake again. Bujubantan, congratulations, my brother. Because we know so your music is powerful. And you're a great musician. And you've done a lot for reggae music and dance all. So, just chat on with the journey and be safe on the journey. From J Progress, believe no man. Who and J Progress entertainment me people? Remember good no man? You not have to ask nobody nothing. Nobody not have to tell you nothing. Because a one J Progress entertainment. Believe. <music>